And happening now at 5 o'clock, breaking news. Burglars target the home of Congresswoman Karen Bass, stealing multiple guns there. The L.A. mayoral candidate calling the incident unnerving. We're live with the all-out search for the thieves. And we want to thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Jonathan Gonzalez. I'm Kathy Vara. NBC4's Lauren Coronado joins us live from LAPD headquarters in downtown L.A. with the very latest. Lauren? Jonathan Cathy, right now I'm on standby waiting for more details from the LAPD, including whether or not any arrests have been made. But here's what we know so far. Congresswoman Karen Bass released this statement reading in part, quote, at this time, it appears that only two firearms, despite being safely and securely stored, were stolen. Cash, electronics, and other valuables were not. It's unnerving, and unfortunately, it's something that far too many Angelinos have faced. It's not clear what time the burglary happened. The congresswoman says she came home last night and, quote, discovered her home was broken into. She says she called the LAPD for help and thanked the department for their quick response. Now, this comes during a contentious time in the race for LA's next mayor. This week, opponent Rick Caruso called on Bass to provide more transparency in her dealings with an indicted USC administrator. Then Bass releasing a digital ad that accused Caruso of covering up sexual abuse allegations at USC. All this happening less than eight weeks until the November election. As for Bass's home being burglarized, we're still awaiting official word from the LAPD. We also reached out to Caruso's campaign for a statement. We're still waiting to hear back. Reporting live in downtown, I'm Lauren Coronado, NBC4 News. Lauren